TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow Industrials finish up 210. You had the Nasdaq up 60. S&P's up 16 and a half. That put the Dow Industrials as well as the Nasdaq up 8 tenths of 1 percent. S&P's up 6 tenths of 1 percent. Gold. Gold contract uh, down, up a dollar 60, trading 12.96. Gold actually saved itself. Uh, it got, got under the low of yesterday. Yesterday was huge volume. Uh, I'd like, would like to see higher price, but the bottom line, it did save itself from... Uh, getting into that lower swing point. Silver, up 12 cents, $15.09. Light sweet crude, having a tough time, still at the $60 level. It was up 86 cents, trading $60.16. Notes and bonds still want higher price in a big way, too. Uh, you had the 10-year note uh, back down six ticks. 30-year bond back, back down seven. In both cases, uh, folks, we back down with light volume. Uh, this week, we hit a low of the last uh, at least 12, longer than 12 months, uh, we're 2.3, uh, 2.366. Uh, we closed at 2.4. It hit 2.366 yesterday. Uh, what that did do, uh, by the way, um, to the uh, mortgage rates, this was the uh, biggest drop in about a decade uh, in one week. Uh, the interest rates uh, on the 15-year uh, 20-year and 30-year mortgage rates dropped like a rock. Uh, so we'll be seeing a lot more financing uh, coming in, into the future. King dollar. King dollar uh, up 71 ticks, trading 96,835. What you have with King dollar? King dollar closed over its uh, February 15th, the swing area. So that's uh, saying that game is on for the highs once again. The, the number at February 15th was 96,685. You're at 96,835. That puts game on. For the March 7th high, which is 97,160. And what that's all about, folks, is that uh, Theresa May got defeated again. Uh, Brexit got defeated again. Uh, bottom line, this was the original Brexit day. Now they're dealing with uh, April 12th. Pound went down. Pound's pushing uh, into the lower part of this consolidation with volume. Now the euro is actually pushing into its lows. And uh, this thing could blow apart. So this is going to be interesting watching this thing shake out. Um, the euro has been uh, also weak in a huge way. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Look forward to speaking right back here next Monday, 9 o'clock.